Well, good evening, and thank you so much for just spending a couple minutes with me as we just praise his holy name again this day, because that's what we were born to do. We were born to praise his name. He created us to have a relationship with us. And the other day I was reading this comment and, you know, I, I wasn't arguing with this person, but they clearly were saying that Jesus was a myth. And I know I already mentioned that to you, but then another person came in on the conversation and said, well, I don't believe in Jesus either, but I'm a good person and I follow the Ten Commandments. And I do nice things for people. And I was like, you are still missing the point. There are so many people that they think that rejecting Jesus or having the argument that Jesus is just a made up person or that he was a prophet, you know, and, and they even will will just literally argue with you and the thing is I, I was telling them I'm like you know what you're missing the point and then I refer them to read John 3 17 because that verse says that Jesus came into the world not to condemn the world but that through him the world might be saved and when you read that through him, see, it's through Jesus that we have amazing grace. It's through Jesus that we have everlasting life. It is through Jesus that we receive this grace and this mercy from Almighty God. It is through Jesus that you can get to the Father. You have to go through God's Son, and that is Jesus Christ, the Messiah. And there are so many people that they don't understand, they don't read their Bible, we're living, we're, you know, I don't want to keep saying that we're living in the last days, but I just watched a video that my cousin in the UK sent me about current this currency is not existing. It's coming. It's happening. There, there were some bankers that got arrested because they were doing this global banking scheme and they got arrested. And that's true. You can look that up. And I wish I would have saved the video because I could have put it in the link description box. But once you read it... Um, you it goes away, and so it vanished. But it's through Jesus, and if everybody would just understand that, I I don't want anybody being deceived. I don't want anybody being face to face with Jesus and having Jesus tell them, "I don't even know who you are. Depart from me." People, you know, when the Bible says there's going to be weeping and gnashing of teeth, can you imagine being a naysayer right now? I mean, just calling Christians crazy, calling us religious fanatics, religious freaks, scaremongers. You know, we are far from scaremongers. I'm a loving mongerer. <laughs> That's just a joke. I just really hope that when people watch the videos that I make, that they research and do their own research on everything that I say. Because I am just a sinner saved by grace. If it weren't for Jesus, I would have no hope. If it weren't for Jesus, I wouldn't even want to live. But I know Jesus is real because I got to see him just for a moment. I, you know, a lot of people haven't had that experience. But that's why I am so determined to 
to reach at least one person. You know, my prayer is whoever watches this video, I want them to have that, that comfort of knowing that, you know what, I know Jesus is my Lord and Savior, so I'm good to go. Because for reals, we're not going to be here much longer, and that's just my two cents. I know it ain't worth nothing, but you see all these people setting dates. Some lady was like, it's going to be September 2nd. And I was like, uh, you're setting a date there, sweetheart. You're not supposed to do that. And, and she had like 30,000 views. And all these people were like, oh, I'm so sorry that I said bad things about you. I think her name was Kat. And they're like, oh, I'm so apologizing to her. And I was just like, you know what? Be ready to go. Nobody knows the day, the hour time only the father in heaven even Jesus doesn't know so my comment was be ready right now because you don't know you don't know and, and this is one another thing to back up God's time table a thousand years is a day to God there are so many people that still need to hear the gospel there are so many people that God does not want to perish. He doesn't want them to perish or die. And yet people are refusing the truth. And that truth still stands today. Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life. He is and I'm going to go because I have a tendency to rattle on and get boring and uninteresting. And I don't want to do that. So I'm going to bid you all a farewell and good night and peace on the day and the night. And I'll see you tomorrow, God willing, or the next day. Because I'm doing videos just every other day now. So I love you. And I'll see you soon. Bye.